name is Frankie Commons, and I was recently challenged by a good longtime friend of mine, best friend if I should say, <clears throat> and probably one of the best drummers I've ever played with ever, Michael Reschke, to uh, take the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge, or Ice Water Challenge, and um, I'm going to accept that challenge, but <clears throat> what I would like to do first is explain to you about ALS. I get the feeling that a lot of people out there are taking this challenge and not really fully understanding what this disease is and um, how it affects um, the people who are afflicted with it. <clears throat> um, ALS, or uh, more common, commonly known as uh, Lou Gehrig's disease, um, affects the motor neurons in the brain. And um, to uh, explain it as simply as possible, we have motor neurons in our brain, which send signals down through our spinal cord, and then from our spinal cord out to our muscles, which allows our brain, or ourselves, to control our muscles. And uh, this basically allows us to, uh, to uh, walk, to talk, to blink, to do all kinds of little things. So as these motor neurons in our brain begin to degenerate, what happens is they begin to die and people begin to not be able to control their muscle functions. Um, the brain no longer sends the signals to the spinal cord and to the muscles. So people with this particular disease, um, as it progresses, they begin to become paralyzed. Um, a lot of them with three to five years lifespan once they've been diagnosed with the particular ah! disease. And um, it's very sad. It reminds me of a uh, guitar player from the 80s, which a lot of my musician's friends will probably remember, or should remember, Jason Becker. Jason Becker played um, for a band called Cacophony. He played with uh, David Lee Roth for a short stint um, before he was diagnosed with ALS and eventually became uh, wheelchair ridden. Um, he's fully paralyzed at this point, still alive to this day. Um, and he's still making music, which is inspiring. So for those of you that remember him, uh, as part of a tribute to him, what I'm doing here today, accepting this challenge. I am doing it for him and, you know, for everybody else, of course, that has ALS. But uh, him in particular stuck out in mind. He was very young and um, he had a phenomenal career ahead of him before stricken with this disease. So let's move on. We're gonna go out back here. So here's the ice water. And ice in a bucket, pot, whatever. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna pour this on myself. Um, doing some other research on my own, I noticed um, that there was uh, some research done on cannabis. And as most of you know, I am a big proponent and um, fan of uh, cannabis, whether smoking it, eating it, using the cannabis oil for curing different types of diseases. And um, uh, doing some research on the internet, I did find that uh, cannabis does have the ability to not only slow the effects of ALS, but also um, allow some of the, the people that have been afflicted with ALS to outlive the doctors that diagnose them with ALS. So something to think about down the road if you want to support cannabis research. All right, so again, this is a horrible disease. Um, I hope someday we do find a cure for it. Um, I do intend to, to uh, donate to the cause, even though I am still going to dump a bunch of cold water on myself here in just a minute. Um, this disease is terrible. I don't think a lot of us take it for granted. Um, When those motor neurons begin to die and we lose control of our muscle functions, we can't even climb down the stairs, play guitar, or pour a bucket of cold ice water over our heads. 
here we go. So here we are back in the studio. Uh, ice challenge completed. Thanks again, Mikey, for nominating me. Appreciate that. Um, so at this point, it's my understanding that we need to nominate three other folks. So the people I like to nominate would be the other half of my band from when I was in the Air Force. Mikey, of course, playing drums for that band, uh, Darkstar. So I'd like to nominate Jim Ritchie. Dennis Clay, and I need to come up with a third person. I'm thinking it's gonna be Phil Stahl. All right, Mikey, thanks again, man. Appreciate it, um, that was fun. Thanks for nominating me. Jim, Dennis, Philly, hope to see you guys doing it. You got 24 hours, at least that's what it says. All right, guys, thanks.